Atalanta beat Napoli. Roma beat Fiorentina. My friends, we have a game in hand, but we are one point clear as of right now. A win would be massive because then there'd be two games left and we'd be four points clear. We will find out this episode, I think, whether or not we make it. Yay. We drew with Lazio 2-2. Kind of exciting game. Really back and forth. Lorenzo and Bond picking up a goal. Bond came out as a sub and rescued us. Good for him. We smashed Genoa 6-2. What was it? It was in the first half. 1-2-3-4-0 at halftime. So we got some Granite and Mary, some Bond, and some Bonnet on. And we still, well, I mean, they kind of got two back and you're like, ooh. But we scored right, like, it was 5-0. Five, five nil in the 46th minute, and then it was 5-2 pretty quickly, and I was like, mm, yeah, it's fine. Go ahead and make your substitutions, you know? Um, oh, dear. Here we go. Evans favorites. I, it's, it's, it's what I got. It's what we've got. Unfortunate. a lot of pressure but it's a fascinating contest it does say they play a possession game and they give up a goal like every 103 minutes and like against a 4-2-3-1 i'm tempted to play a 4-2-3-1 and press but i i think they're too good for that so i'd rather play a 3-4-3 five defenders see if we can make something happen that way Okay, it just turns the sounds on. All right, Serge, early days. Come on, son. Just go ahead and get us the goal in the first minute, please. Thank you for that. That was lovely. It's been a minute since he's done that. Now, they didn't put four defenders in the wall, so, you know, that's helpful. But cheers to Serge. Smashed it home. That was amazing. Does that play into our hands a little bit, right? Like, where now they have to come at us. Oh, oh I thought we were going to see the highlight, like the, the goal line technology. Didn't matter. It didn't, wasn't over, but, you know, we're, we're playing slightly more defensive. I've taken also off uh, the passing into space. We still have really good pace in comparison to the rest of the league. Um... Our acceleration isn't as good, so I'm wondering if now, like, we have really talented passers where they could, like, it's not just ping it into space. It's ping it to your, the player making the run and see how that goes. So maybe it was general was not very good. Maybe it was that. Maybe it was a 4 2 3 one. I'm not sure, but it worked out. So we're going to try it here. He says, going, did I? Yeah, I did take it off. We're not working the ball in the box. Like, we're still, you know, but it's just instead of trying to loop it into space and run onto it, especially against a team like Juventus, it's like actually pass it to the player and see if you can get it to their feet and let them do something with it. Like get dispossessed or to dribble past. Okay, that works. Ibrahim picks up the pieces. Surge! Oh, I just, it's just amazing. It just amazes me. He can get into... Oh, dear. Tight calf, but he's, he's bouncing back. We're going to get a notification that he... He can play through it. Yep, there it is. Oh, and then he can't. He can play through it until his leg rips off. So, Ibrahim once again with a little bit of a knock makes you nervous. Ooh. Oh, okay. Keeper didn't know anything about it, did he? He was walking the other direction. Goodness me. Guard against complacency, boys. I believe in you. Please, I believe in you. I'm not happy with you. Lothar, you're on the line. You're on a 6.5. Come on. They're really frustrated, nervous. Yellows. I, I mean, 
it's a bruised ankle. Can they stop trying to like physically ruin my players with all their yellows? I mean, that seems a little unnecessary, don't you? Cleared, massive clearance. Holy guacamole. Colabani has, oh, he's got a runner. Oh, he heavy touch. He had the runner to pass to. I thought he was all by himself. That's what I was about to say. And then I saw whoever that was. Maybe it was Lothar making that sprint. Surge gets down to block that. Interesting. Paul works for, okay. Oreo, Oreo, Oreo. Oh, dear. Okay. Calm as you like, but not for me. Okay, Surge collects. Gets it on. Okay. This is... <laughs> there we go. Just hold it for a second. There you... I like that. It was kind of like... All over the place. Oriole plays it. Forward. Lothar. Lothar. Oh! Picks out a pass! De Silva. Four points... Could be enough, you think? I mean, it depends. We do play Enter. It depends on who the other teams are playing. But right now, 2-0. Surge with a bruised ankle. Oh, Lothar off the post. Oh, so close. So close, son. Columbani. Oh, oh. Oh, it's a goal kick. Okay, I was like, why are they... I was trying to figure out where they were running to. I, like, did it skim off his head? It, it hadn't. Okay, we are going to take... He's having a great game, but we're going to take him off. Just because he's looking exhausted. Um, we're going to bring on Lorenzo on the wing. Because he, he likes... Uh, he's a left-footed player. That's fine. Got one sub left to make if we need it. The clock is ticking. And pausing. Four minutes added on. Take the silver off. Bring on Brogy. You know what? He could do a box to box. Sure. Just to give him a little bit of game time. Don't need as going forward. He can go run up and down, but we don't need to boom. Advanced playmaker bombing forward, right? Tackle. Now get up and do it again. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. Ooh. Oh, good tackle. Lothar helps out, but it's a pass. It's a it's a tackle pass. I don't know what you would call it. I was trying to figure out a word to call that. Oh, dear. We just let him waltz up, didn't we? Just waltz right on up. Not like this, boys. I'm not watching that. That was awful. Is it enough? Okay. Mm, we get rid of the clean sheet bonuses. I'm still. I mean, it's still a good game, right? Like, fair play. Four points clear. Two games left. It could still go the wrong direction, right? Um, tight calf. Okay, no no serious injuries. I, I'll take care of this. We'll be right back. Oh, what, just because it brought up their manager. In the press conference before the game, it said, what do you think about his ability to work with limited finances? What? <laughs> I'm very, I'm back to being confused by this. It says we've qualified for the Champions League. How? Hold on, let's. Oh, uh, what the f Euro Cup? Yeah. Tottenham and Madrid. So it's not like we. I was thinking, like, did one of our 
the teams behind us win the Europa League and therefore they're in, or I, there's six points left, right? There's there's 20 teams. Okay. There's 38 games. Like obviously we've we've guaranteed a Europa League spot. Milan is also in the Europa League, but like if Atalanta wins both of their games and we lose, they'll have 76 points and we would have 74. And if Roma won both of their games, do they like play each other or something where that's not possible? They play Atalanta. So like that game was a draw. They each have 71 if they won their next game. But I guess maybe we've got... Okay, we drew the Atalanta here. And we drew with them here. And we beat Roma there. And we beat Roma there. Is it because we've got the the result against Roma? Like uh Okay. I mean yay, but Okay, good. I was a little worried that we hadn't spent the money, but they've they've left it in they've left it in the kitty. And now we've got forty million to go spend. And the same roughly one point seven million. So we can go again, this is what I was thinking, right? Like we we maybe sell Bon and maybe Kluga. We might keep him. It depends on if we can find a like a young backup, right? Um we're trying to sell Messina. He's got lots of suitors. Now, will they pay $15 million? Who knows? Um, we get this guy that's going to be joining us, who's going to get sent out on loan. Or, yeah, yeah, he's going to get sent out on loan. If Assuming he'll accept it. Because he's going to come in on July 1st, and it, since he was a free, he didn't give me the option to say we're going to throw you out on loan. But, um, you know, I'm a little disappointed in this guy, Gabriel, on a 693. You know, so do we go find a stud center back and another, I don't know. Like, we have a really good first team, and then this is the only glaring star issue. Now, so you could argue a little bit, but we kind of knew that. Amari's coming up, though. I don't know. I, I'm really befuddled. Let, let's. I'm going to show you the other game, because I said I was going to show you the other game, but I was just like, ah, ah. that's not good. We need Grandi. Mate. No, mate. No. No. I don't want to keep Kluga. Oh, no. It's because AC Milan is coming, sniffing around. He's been solid. He's been solid. Now, he does have a year left on his contract. So, I'm not saying, I, yeah, let's see if Surge can solve the problem. It's always good. Yes. Problem solved. And Paul Colombani is happy to stay at the club. I don't even remember him coming to me to talk about it. But, apparently, he was thinking about it. And now, he's like, no, no, no. Let's forget that. I think we're going to lose to Silva. I tried to offer him a new contract, and there's so many teams interested. Like, he, he, all the things his agent wanted was, like, improved defenders, which I plan on doing. I was like, cool. Treat the club as a stepping stone, which is not good, because that means there's going to be a low uh, minimum release clause in there. Um, what else? Star player, which he already is. There was something else where I was like, I, I, I can't, you know, and... Uh, just taking off the stepping stone part, he was like, no, we're, we're not doing it. So we're probably going to lose him. It's just been in the news that clubs are thinking about offering $74 million and he's worth $64 million. But when you have this, right, this to me indicates, you know, a, a bidding war, right? So $96 million is great, and, and like, yeah, that'd be nice, twenty million, right? Like, but I don't have another one scouted. I don't have another De Silva ready, and that would be problematic, I think. So, um, we are snooping around as well, like the Premier League and Bundesliga teams that are getting relegated, to see if they have any good like center backs or youth prospects that we could snag, like if they have a relegation release clause or something like that. Same thing with like a, you know, Gabriel Bond esque striker. Um, so we're we're sniffing around. We're gonna play our best team today. Um, and then the last game will do a lot, not a lot of rotating, but I'll, I'll plan to rotate a little bit here, um, around halftime or 60 minutes. Um, Inter just fired their manager, um, which is kind of odd. Um, but can we go out and make a statement of intent? 
Oh, the other thing that DeSilva wanted was, like, for us to win the title next year. I'm like, well, the board already is asking for that in the future. I don't think it's next year, but they're asking for it the year after. We're like, come on, bro. Um, but I just... I don't know what else I could have done, right, when we signed him, right? The buyout fee was great, and, you know, maybe six months into his first contract with us, we should have re-upped and offered him 190 grand a year and gotten rid of it, but... Eh. I don't know. I don't know if that's realistic. So maybe that's just part of the part of the business and you buy him for 20 and you sell him for 96 minus what all the bonuses that we've paid him um, and the, the uh, signing on bonus and all that kind of stuff and we move on. It It's just like that would be gutting because I don't think, right, Brogy isn't ready uh, to take any type of, of spot over from midfield. He's getting there, but like that would leave a pretty big gap in the team. Um so maybe we can have, I don't know, Serge and Colomani talk to him. Oh, jeez. Come on, boys. We're at home, you know? Again? Same thing? Oh, well, we got a tackle in, but... Okay, got some help. Surge going the wrong direction, but he does find his partner. Okay, I was a little nervous there, and now he's where? Where? You, where is he going? <laughs> Ibrahim, how you got it? How you got it, son? Nice, good reaction. I didn't have to yell or anything. They just did it on their own. That's not bad. We'll take that. We'll take that. That was good. Hold on, I'm checking something. Sorry. Six point three error prone. Well, lovely. Put Kluga in the shop window at halftime. Probably. I don't know though. It it depends. It depends on what happens with Grandi. He he said he's good, but like, is he really good? Does he really want to stay? Um, do we do we bring Renee Gall back? to take on that role, but like Grandi has played more obviously than Kluga has, so do we loan Rene Gall again to you know, get him a full season with FC Copenhagen, you know, up the up the fee maybe a little bit, earn some money on him? Um, I don't know. It's, I'm going to have lots of things to think about in the offseason and I'm sure it'll be fun to react to oh, De Silva's gone or whatever, right? Like trying to figure that out. Six shots, a clear-cut chance. Let's go. Oh, he's offside. Oh, I thought he was offside. That's all part of the plan. He's going to hit it off the post and, uh, or off the bar, I should say, and then uh, smack it up. Sounds good. Lovely. Well You would think we'd be better than a manager less intern that is on like 50 something points. But we're at home too. Oh, come on, just there you go. There you go. Nice job. Play it back out there. Play it back out there. Okay, they covered it. That's fine. Oh, there you go. Still got it to him. He's going to zip it in like he does. Oh, oh, oh. The net fluttered a little bit. In the net fluttered a fuzz. Colombane. Oh, I don't know why I say Colin Body's name that way, you know? Ooh, we're running all over the place, aren't we? That was a little aggressive from... I don't have that on, Lothar, okay? He's kind of, he's, he's kind of lost me saying Lothar because he's not, you know, played exceptionally well. And it keeps saying that he's wanting a new contract. That might have something to do with it, but, like, dude, you're on 31 and a half grand and you've not played well, so, like... I don't feel motivated to offer you a contract, and that play was so good. Please don't leave the silver. Like it's almost depressing now. You know, you're like, please, could you, could you please not, could you please not leave the team? Pretty please. Look at this. We'll watch this one again. Ibrahim cuts inside to Silva. <sighs> Try this. Mm. Mm. That was good. 
Very pleased. We're going to give Lorenzo a run out. You're being error prone. We'll give Kluga shop window time. That'll be all that we do for right now. But the double sub... Yeah, that might be aggressive, right? Double subage at halftime. But it's like, yay. We've already qualified for the Champions League, and the difference between third and fourth from a financial standpoint isn't huge, and we have a two-goal lead. So, like, you know, like, eh. Call money sticks with. Flicked on to Silva Collects. Ooh, that was a risky pass. Is that a gray-haired Rios? How old's Rios? He looks like he's got gray hair. I kind of like it. No judgment. I like the whistling. It's good. Lots of Ole. Lots of Ole. Oh, lovely. Colombani. Oh, Serge is there. Oh, oh, unselfish by Serge to play that back. I thought he was going to turn and take a shot, but instead. Ibrahim? Oh. Oh, money on a 9.5 on a hat trick. That's it. Took too much time to get the ball to him. He was already running. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Another surge, another. Just ping it in there. Oh! Maybe so gets the first goal. <laughs> it's kind of hard to see from that camera angle. Let's see what happened. Oh, dear. Three clear-cut chances. We have been dominant. Where was this against Milan? I'm just saying. Yeah, he just beat him there. He just beat that defender that was coming to help out. Ay, ay, ay. Um... I need a Mary to, to, to come good. So we're going to take out Oriol because he's going to be here next season. So uh, of the of the rotational options, Amari, I think, is probably the closest to playing for us. Um, then like a Noah Bonnet. I mean, Brogy's probably up there too, but Brogy's gotten time. So we'll give Amari a run out, and then we'll start Brogy and some others in the, the last game of the season against Simply. Please don't leave. I'm going to say that every single time he's in a highlight. Please don't leave. Play. Oh, he's going to play it? No, he's just going to take it on his own. Oh, he's going to lay it off. Nope. Oh, dear. That's not what the doctor ordered. Oh, dear. Lower leg injury is... Okay, hold on. <sighs> yeah, that looks good. After such a good game... That's deflating. Sometimes it feels like Fulminer just twists the knife. It's because I mentioned the, the Coppa Italia final. That's just why. Just, just let him come on in. I can't believe he missed that. Goodness. Please don't be a horrible injury. Like, please be back by the beginning of next season. Not so bad. I am starting to wonder if he has a problem with injuries. Like, slight, 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 moderate, you know? Like, is that... Oh, hello. Doesn't say it in his thing, but... All right, my friends. Um, we've guaranteed ourselves third. We're not going to overcome an 11-goal difference, assuming Napoli loses. 
But let's come back to see the kids next time. And then we'll do end of season awards and all that kind of stuff. Lots of stuff to think about. Let me know what you think about that episode. Two wins. I kind of wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting after the first one to already have locked it in. But I guess I should have looked at their schedules. We'll see you then. Yay!